It's educational, it's entertaining, it's flexible. It's going to be used from everything from the uh, regular programs that we're going to show, including little kids, to use it with corporations, use it with outside partners. There's, there's incredible breadth, depth, in this immersive, spectacular environment that we've created here. The nice thing is we can do live shows. So coming into the show, uh, we, we did our member preview last Saturday. So we asked the audience what they wanted to see, and we would pick a selection of that to throw in. So on the fly, I can throw in whatever. Uh, if we're building pre-recorded shows, it's still a lot more flexible. But the, the really the key is, you know, is that instantaneous kind of live presentation style we can get to. Uh, you can call it out, and as soon as I can bring it up on the system and type it in, we can we can fly there and go there. But where it's really amazing is this new digital system that we have. We've got two 4K projectors, so the image quality is super bright. Uh, and, and then the planetarium system itself is such an improvement. You know, If you think of what you would typically think of when you saw old uh, astronomy shows, being stuck on the Earth, looking up at the stars, now we can take you anywhere in the universe at a click of a button, and we can incorporate you know, real-time video and graphics into the system. Imagine you know, video games, any kind of video, any kind of audio, I can instantly drop into the system and pull up. So it's much more flexible, and the image quality is a lot better. The shows are uh, about 40 minutes. We'll have three shows that we launch with. The first one's called Our Universe Above, and that's that's kind of the traditional astronomy show. We'll take a look at what you would see in the night sky, so uh, as the days change, that show will change. We'll take a look at some deep space objects and things in our solar system, and we'll also spend a decent chunk of time in that show talking about current happenings with science. Uh, right now, we're, we'll be focusing on the Orion test launch missions that are coming up in December, and some information on Rosetta as well, you know, because humans landed on a comet for the first time just uh, just the last week. Uh, we also have a Sesame Street Early Childhood show. It's called One World, One Sky. It's the only place you can see it. It's a planetarium exclusive show. There'll be some live content on that as well. And then for the holidays, we're running a, a double feature of uh, The Alien That Stole Christmas, which is based on a Dr. Seuss book. It's a computer graphics animation. There's some, a winter sky tour in that as well. And then we're running some uh, shorts from Clark's Planetarium show, Let It Snow. That's a collection of holiday music. It's really wonderful graphics. Yeah, so we'll open on Saturday the 22nd. Starting on Saturday the 22nd, we'll be open every single day that Coastside's open doing shows all day long.